In this session, we'll be discussing about bacteria related to human affairs. Now, when you talk about bacteria related to human affairs, there can be bacteria, those can cause you the diseases. Those are actually harmful bacteria. Now, you should know what is the disease and what is the bacteria related about that particular disease. Because some other the time, they would ask you, they'll give you some other the diseases. They would ask you which among the following is a bacterial disease. Or they can also ask you the causal name of that particular organism which is causing the disease. You should know about some of the diseases which are really important for humans and those are important for plants as well. Now, there are the diseases like cholera which has been caused by Vibrio cholerae. We have already discussed Vibrio cholerae is a bacteria which is comma shaped. So that comma shaped Vibrio cholerae causes cholera. You must have heard about typhoid and the sal Salmonella typhi or sometimes it can be written as Salmonella typhimurium. Hopefully you remember Salmonella was used as a bacteria in one of the experiments when we are talking about sexual reproduction in bacteria. So Salmonella typhi, which is also be written as Salmonella typhimurium, causes typhoid. Clostridium titani, Clostridium titani causes titanus. You have mycobacterium. There are two uh, basically specific of uh, what you call mycobacterium. One is Mycobacterium tuberculosis, which causes tuberculosis. One is Mycobacterium lapare, that causes laparosi. Now, Mycobacterium lapare and Mycobacterium tuberculosis, that's a very famous institute in India, if you've heard about, National Jalma Institute for Laparosi and other mycobacterial diseases, which is at Agra. They are basically dealing with this particular bacteria, these particular bacteria and the diseases like that. Pasturella pestis, which is also called Yastinia pestis, it causes plague. You have Xanthomonas etc. So from here, we have talked about the bacteria, those are related for plants. Those have caused the diseases to plants. So Xanthomonas cetera, it's a citrus canker disease. Citrus canker, what happens in lemon leaf, uh, you get some spots because of the bacterial infection and the photosynthesis is not proper in that particular leaf. That basically happens in what you call lemon. We talk about Xanthomonas oryzae. Oryzae, the name suggests it, it must be for related to oryzae and the rice scientific name is oryzae sativa. So this particular bacteria causes bacterial blight in rice. You have one very important bacteria which is also called natural genetic engineer which is used as to transfer the genetic material from what you call one bacteria to another bacteria to carry what you call the gene of interest. So Agrobacterium tumefaciens it causes crown gall diseases which is also called plant tumor in plants. So these are the bacteria which are harmful which are causing some or the other diseases in humans, plants, animals. There may be many more I have listed so far so much. Next session we will be discussing about some economic importances of bacteria.